Isabella. <gasps> if I wanted to kill you, you'd be already dead. What do you want? I want to know why you've done a deal with the devil. Why do you care? The prince is evil. It's not every day a prince asks you to be sheriff. Especially if you're a woman. Well, you'd be working with a traitor. No, I'm working for myself. I intend to be the best sheriff Nottingham has ever seen. <laughs> and you'll see for yourself tomorrow. No. It'll never work. Because the prince will fall. And you'll fall. Unless... What? Unless you work with me. Keep me in the picture, tell me the prince's plans. And I'll protect you when the king returns. What if I don't want to be your friend? Then you'll find out what it is to be my enemy. Mm. Are you threatening me, Robin Hood? I could destroy you whenever I choose. Mm. So what's stopping you? You think it over, Isabella. The offer's open, but not forever. It's Robin Hood. We'll sound the alarm! Quick, stop it! Guard the exit! Isabella, you haven't seen anything yet. Well, this should be interesting. Well, not that interesting. Look, what exactly are we doing here? Robin thinks he can charm my new sheriff into working with outlaws. Look, let's just see what she's made of, shall we? Well, it's not sugar and spice and all things nice. Meg Bennett, the sheriff's court has heard of your disobedience to your father and your refusal to accept any suitors he chose for you. Lady Sheriff, one was a drunken sot, the second looked like a donkey, and the, the third was a half wit with the brains of a tree. You little wretch. Please! <laughs> and the fourth, you apparently bribed to go back to York with money you stole from your father. He was a mummy's boy, what use is that? Meg, tell the court why you acted in such a deplorable fashion. Because I won't accept anyone telling me how to live my own life. I don't want to marry. I, men are so... Stupid! <laughs> Quiet! I think England would be a much better place if women were in charge. <laughs> Dream on, girl. Untie her. What? Thank you. People of Nottingham. Now maybe you can see the kind of sheriff I am. And as I've set Meg here free, I intend to set the whole of Nottingham free. Yeah! To be a fairer, more peaceful and prosperous place for us all. Yeah! You are far too bright to be locked up. I think I need people like you around me. The last regime was brutal and corrupt and in recognition of crimes committed against the people. My brother, Guy of Gisborne, shall be executed here on Thursday at midday. See, maybe we can work with him. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Bravo! Isn't she marvelous? How I've missed you. My lovely wife. Get off me. I'm your new sheriff. Thornton, at your service. I'm sure you'll understand that my wife now has me to care for, leaving me to care for you. Rest assured, you are in firm and capable hands. Now, if you'll excuse me, the little wife and I have some catching up to do. I no deal with Thornton. We should get going, Robbie. The villagers have been expecting a food drop. I know, you go. I need to stay here, find out his next move. Bye. I'm staying too. No, it's all right, much. You go. I'll stay. Cool. Cared for you. We were so happy together. How can you say that? <laughs> Johnson, no, he has the criminal for a sheriff. He appointed me, he trusts me. You abandoned your husband, broke man's law and God's. Now, my men will ride to him at nightfall if they receive no word of my safety. Release me, or it's over. Let him go. Dead man's crossing in the forest. I think I know it. If you've told a lie, it'll be your last. Lock her up. Listen, I won't miss until you're free. Oh, look at them, boys. The ladies are getting a little emotional. <laughs> you stay strong. Thornton's dangerous. For Isabella, maybe. No, for Nottingham, for everyone. Whereas your Isabella's an angel. I just think we can work together with her, unlike him. You are so wrong. I'm not wrong. Can't you see? See what? Can't you see her for what she really is? Oh, Kate, why are you so angry with me? I should probably go. staring at. I know you. You're him, aren't you? Isabella's brother. She's a friend of mine. Not that close, obviously. Her nasty husband did this to me. Clever. Thornton. <laughs> Is he here? <laughs> She's terrified of it. Well, she shouldn't have run off and left him then, should she? You always were a bit pleased with yourself. I saw you once. The man in black on his black horse. The big I am. <laughs> Look at you now. Dirty and miserable and small. And now you're going to be executed. By the look of it, you might not be far behind. 
I hope you go to hell. I'm already there. This is it. Get going then. Don't you understand? Every time you cross me, every little word or action, you make it worse for yourself when I get you on my own in a small, dark room. Now go on. Prove you love me. Get digging. This is a wild goose chase. I'll kill that girl. Look. Let me see. Uh. Get some more men, you. What are you waiting for? Get digging. Oh, well, come on. Get on with it. No, 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 no. Not fair, you idiot. He really is a pig, isn't he? Yep. Yeah. Unless there's something you and Isabella agree on. Listen, um... About what happened earlier. I know. I'm sorry. What for? Difficult, isn't it? Is it? Why? Because of Isabella? No, not because. It's just the way we live, you know, and and then there's much. Much. Right, you lot. I want the treasure out of here by nightfall. I'd best get the others. Just look after yourself. Yeah. Yeah, you too. Just leave it, will you? Well, it hurts. That's why they do it. Deal with it. I'm thirsty. Well, then save your breath and stop whining. Nasty piece of work you, aren't you? No wonder Isabella wants you dead. What did he do to her anyway? Oh, give me strength. It's almost worth dying to be spared your endless chatter. Oh, come on. You're here, I'm here. What else are we going to do? I found her a husband. That's what I did. Good price, too. You sold her? Your own sister. It's her best chance in life. It's not my fault she went and made a mess of well, it. Well, of course it is. All of it. You sold it to a monster. You stupid girl. You know nothing about it. I'm not stupid girl. I'm Meg. And I'm still thirsty. That stone around your neck. Suck it. It'll make your mouth water. by the look of it. Place curses on horses' heads to ward off intruders. What are you doing? 
Get a grip. Just a horse's head. Golden bridle. Nice. Now I'd say that's a chief's. It's the treasure. They bury it with them for the long journey to Valhalla. Where is that? It's near Norwich, isn't it? No, Alan. Valhalla is Norse for heaven. My beautiful wife. What's going on in that pretty little head of yours? Nothing at all. Just the way you like it. What have you taken? Steal from me, would you? Just looking. Let that be a lesson to you all. Now get the cart. Fetch the cart. The sooner the gold's back in Nottingham, the better. You four start loading the gold into the cart. Right. We get rid of him. Let's take his gold first. We'll make Isabella sheriff again. <laughs> sheriff. Live a donkey for our bishop. Shh. Kane, I want you to stay and watch the horde. And watch you too. The rest of you come and make one. You're on my land. Well, you pay me a toll. I guess we might forget about it. <laughs> That's not very nice now, is it? <laughs> Are you scared? What of? <laughs> what of? Your date with the executioner. Do I look scared? Actually, no. Terrible, yeah. One out of ten for personal appearance. But not frightened. I'm almost impressed. It's as if you've got a clear conscience. Well, why shouldn't I have? Because of all the awful things you've done in your life. I mean, no one actually seems sorry that you're on the way out, do they? Does that not make you sad? Can't help what people think of me. What's done is done. And if I am to die, then so be it. Is your life really that empty that you don't care whether you live or die? There must be some good in you yet. You don't know me. Besides, I thought you hated men. I do. I do. Start loading the gold now onto the cart. Much. Come along, oh. quickly. Can I talk to you about something? Have a cold day. You, come on. I really like Robin. And I think he likes me. But he won't anything happen. Maybe because of you. Would you talk to him for me? Tell him that we're just friends. Yeah. Of course. Much when the cart's ready, I want you to get it out there. All right? Go.
Thanks, my friend. I shall enjoy spending your ill-gotten gains. You want to be careful. He might come back to haunt you. You're the one who's living a nightmare, precious. That's it. We're done. Whoa. Start loading. All right, let's get it loaded. Isn't this my lucky day? My first day of sheriff and untold riches fall into my lap. That can easily change. Right, let's go! This horde isn't yours to take, Thornton. And who's gonna stop me? Robin Hood. <laughs> He's a fella! He's with you, Dennis! You lot with me! The rest get the cart out of here! Fight the cart! I really like Robin. And I think he likes me. We haven't got time for this. We have to find Thornton. Uh, look, there's something I have to tell you. What are you talking about? Come on, we have to go! I was a fool to turn my back on you. Please help me. If you promise to fight with us for King Richard, then I'll protect you. Yes, of course. You and me, Robin. I think we can work together. I've always known it, and I think you do too. It's a deal. You won't regret this. How can I repay you? Well, you can start by handing over the gold. Tomorrow at Night's Glade. Of course. You must give it back to the people. It's theirs after all. Good. Isabella, you'll suffer for this! Isabella! John, escort the sheriff back to her castle. Thank okay. you. This way. She always manages to get what she wants, doesn't she? Kate, just leave it. Please. Superstitious peasant. Viking curse to be visited by suffering, madness, and death. Playing with the devil. 
big mistake, Thornton. You don't say much, do you? Robin Caesar is an ally. Strictly business. Oh, difficult man. There's nothing ever strictly business between a man and a woman. If he has done a deal with you, it's for the good of the cause, nothing else. How can you be so sure? Because I know Robin. My guess is if he's got eyes for anyone, it's for Kate, not you. We found her in the forest! Probably something about Viking ghosts. He's gonna be locked up. Yep, Madhouse is the best place for him. He's a danger to himself and the people around him. And if he mentions something about being sheriff of Nottingham, just pay no attention. Well, he was the Queen of Sheba last week. Well, Nottingham's well rid of you, Thornton. And don't even think of coming back. Because if you do, your next destination won't be an asylum, but where you really belong. Hell. Release her. There's a bat at your back, you man. Thank goodness. I'm not so sure my brother will feel the same. Come on, let's go. Won't you release Guy, too? What? Are you mad? He's our enemy. But... Uh... Oh, you see? Do you see how they manipulate us? A few hours in a cell with a cold-hearted killer and even you lose your wits. That's the poison of men, Meg. None of them can be trusted. My brother will get exactly what he deserves. Now, come on. I want some guards behind me, and I want the rest of them hidden. Understood? Good. All right. So, I write to you with a grave confession that I hope you will find in your heart to forgive. By way of an apology, I would like to offer you a gift. Meg? What are you doing? 
I can't let her kill you. I just can't. Do this for me. <laughs> Thank you. Well, this is touching. Go! <laughs> she didn't know what she was doing! Yes, she did. How could you? I set you free and this is how you repay me. We're not the same. I try to do things out of love. You're doing this out of hate. How dare you! I suppose I should be grateful. No, I know the only person I can trust is myself. I'm on my own. You put yourself there, Isabella. I could say the same for you. And if you two lovebirds want to be together, that's fine. You shall. You'll both die. Come on. We don't want to be late for night's glade. And where's Mudge? Probably attempting to catch breakfast. Hey, are you all right? Fine. Let's just go. Don't be late for Isabella. Hey, this is for the good of everyone. If we can get a sheriff working... Yeah, yeah, I know, I well, know. Listen to me! When we get back, I think me and you need to sort a few things out. Robin, there's really no need. And she's obviously your priority. She's worth more than any treasure. Don't let her slip through your fingers. Came, then. I am glad. Of course. We had a deal, you and me, remember? I do remember. Working together. For the good of Nottingham. Oh, absolutely. That's all that matters now, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Please, take it. You earned it. You were my knight in shining armour. Yeah, that's me. Life's full of disappointment, isn't it? No, I've decided to stand on my own two feet. Thought about what you said. Obey your every command, do whatever you say. I offered you friendship. No, you threatened me. I'll not be some frightened little woman. Go on, take them! Well, it looks like you were right. I usually am. Next time you might just listen. There is a next time. Where did you go, then? Uh, nowhere. Just, uh, wanted to be alone, that's all. Hey, come on, you can tell me. You weren't leaving, were you? Much? Where'd you spring off from? Hey? Uh... You all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Robin, what's the plan? We're gonna take that horde back... ...today, at noon. What about Gisborne's execution? Well, it's a perfect distraction. Well, we make our move as soon as everybody's looking to the 
platform. When he comes out, we slip inside. Alan, Tuck, go through the armory. John, through the kitchen with much. Kate, can you come with me to the West Gate? We'll go from there. Go on. Bring out the prisoners. experience. Guy of Gisborne is an enemy of the people. He must pay the ultimate penalty. This woman tried to help him escape justice. Therefore, she must share his fate. In future, if anyone challenges my authority, they shall suffer the same punishment. Have the condemned any final words? Very well, Isabella, you win. Kill me if you must, but not her. I'll do whatever you want. But don't take her life. Proceed with the execution! She's just an innocent girl! <laughs> what do we do? I said proceed! For once. I agree with Gisborne. No! Hood. Get him! Come on, come on! Isabella! <laughs> Didn't think you'd get rid of me that easily, did you? No! I told him not to come back. I warned him. I have to sort this out. Yeah, take this. I'll catch you up. Come on, go! No, you don't! Don't you dare! It's over! Just leave me alone! You're finished! I warned you. Don't come any closer. You're going to die, Isabella. Please. No, I beg you, please. I'll give you everything you want. Just let me live. I see now. I'll be a good wife. I'll show you the love of a good woman. Get up. Stop sniveling, will you? What have you done? What I should have done years ago. Isabella! Your first murder, Sherry. You were supposed to finish him off, but you weren't man enough for the job. I only kill when there's no other way! You'll get the blame for this as far as Prince John is concerned. The murderous hood's still at large, but not for long! Listen to me! <laughs> We've taken your precious hood. And in case you're wondering, 
the deal's off. <laughs> Let's go. Say it, you know. Say what? Say what? You're dying to. All right. I told you so. <laughs> you finally saw what sort of a woman she really is. Yeah, I did. I'm not sure what sort of woman you are. You're brave. Passionate and you're beautiful. Make sure all of Thornton's men are dead. I don't want Prince John hearing any more lies about me. See to it. will be you, Robin Hood. <laughs> 